Hey folks, John Thompson, Spring Framework Guru here. In this section of the course, we're going to take a look at Spring XML configuration. Previously, I mentioned that Spring originally started out on XML then in Java 5 when they came out with annotations. They started moving towards a Java-based configuration, but there's still a lot of XML configuration out there. The Spring community is definitely moving towards a preference of using the Java configuration, but the XML configuration is still fully supported and there's a lot of legacy stuff out there. It's not unexpected that you'll see the XML being used, especially on legacy applications. And there's just a lot of uh, Spring developers out there that are simply more comfortable using the XML configuration. You can do everything you can do in the annotation-based Java configuration that you can do in XML. There used to be a little bit of a mismatch there where the XML had more capabilities, but as the file-on releases since 3.1 and Spring 4 and 4.1 and 4.2 have come out. Each time there's been additional capabilities added to the annotation-based Java configuration. So they're pretty much on par right now, but you're still going to see in the workplace, especially, you're still going to see XML configuration out there being used. So I wanted to include a, a module in this course to show you the XML configuration. Now, as you wire up the Spring Beans, really doesn't matter if it comes out of a Java configuration or XML configuration. They both get merged up into the Spring context. And the Spring context is actually what's going to be uh, managing the inversion of control as that how your application gets wired up. It really, it, it absolutely doesn't matter what source is in the, the bean into the context, whether it comes from a Java configuration, uh, annotation-based component, or an XML configuration, they all, all get brought in just the same. But in this module, I want to make sure to cover the XML configuration and let you see it in action and also let you see how it can be used intermingled with the Java-based configuration.